So uh, last time we weren't able to find out how the linkages were supposed to be, but this time while everyone was off camera, he figured out that it was supposed to be like, the disc thing wasn't supposed to be like in between the, in between like the little notch, right? Right. We'll have to show, I guess, what it is. Yeah, but... we, we can't really explain it good with words. So, well, you'll see it in there, in there. Yeah. yeah, he thinks like the notch was supposed to like where you can put grease and it will slowly let out while the car is being driven, right? Yeah, I'm not, yeah, possibility, possibility, or it just jumped up and out of place or somebody else had pro maybe, who knows how you, many years ago other people have messed with it. Yeah. So, so. Because uh, on the steering wheel, we saw like marks showing that someone was hitting on it with a hammer. Yeah, to get the steering wheel off and other things, obviously other people have, you know, well, if you don't have the right puller, that's what a hammer's for, right? But anyways. Yeah. So yeah, and we set all that too. We're able to set all the, the covering up and everything inside by the steering wheel, where it's at, the, the shifter, because it used to be right away when you started shifting, you'd hit the, almost hit the, the bottom of the steering wheel and they're trying to shift up and into, into like uh, uh, reverse. And now when everything's set up, that thing can, that shifter can be rocked up and down, doesn't hit anything, it moves, I believe it, it just, moves the way it should it be. It just slides in yeah. perfectly. So. And uh, we're gonna be uh, showing us some footage driving it and the fluid drive, each gear has a high and low mode, right? From what I've read on the high gear, I think there's three. Well, anyways, like right. if the camera on the microphone is good enough, you can hear us like take the foot off the gas and then hear it engage into high mode. Right, right. Because so I think it's, in the book, I think it's five speed, five gears, five yeah. speed, I think, in there. Yeah, I think so, yeah. it's three speed and each gear except reverse has its own high, low modes. Right, right, so. So we'll figure it out. We'll make, you know, next time, next time you may have a different uh, answer. Yeah. To what we believe is the truth. Yeah, we're gonna bring, we're gonna go to some guys that have been working on transmission since forever. And we're gonna have a few questions. Yeah. So like right now, we're gonna show you what we did to fix the linkages, show us driving and we have a 1948 Willie CJ two-way that we managed to bring back from the dead because it's been parked for almost a year or two. Got the motor running today. It's not ready to drive because we're gonna need a we're gonna put a Saginaw steering uh, box. Steering we, box we on a, it. We had to cut out the steering yeah. rod. Steering's all torn out right now, but because yeah. someone someone welded the bits together. Yeah, yeah, because it's yeah, yeah. So not that it's gonna be. It, uh, it also doesn't have, it's not original anymore either. The 48 Willys no, no, isn't. No. It's, got, it, a v, it's, it's got a V6, it, yeah, got a V6 in it. It's so. supposed to come with like a dinky little four cylinder. Right. So, it's, so now it's got a, it's got a, a, a Buick 225 V6 from a car. Maybe, right. There's a couple different yeah, on that, those. Yeah, like, but anyways, the same Buick was in a few CJ5s, but we're, we know it's just from a normal car, right? So it's got that, and instead of having the um, instead of having the um, uh, uh, first, second, third reverse trans transmission in it, it's from a Cherokee. We got the no, 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 no. it's yeah. from a Ford. It's a Ford '70s. I can't remember the name of it. Next time I'll, I'll have my paperwork and know. But so it's got um, it's got it's like a Granny first. So it's granny yeah. first, yeah, that's then it's then it's first, second, third. So you, I think. Anyway, so it's better that way, way better. So so it's really a low gear drive because you get the granny yeah, granny well, first on it. Almost everything mechanical's done on this. So we have another thing to show you. Like almost most of the mechanical problems, they're fixed. Yeah, I believe so. Until we drive it some more. Yeah. So now we have something new to show you. Show the Jeep. Oh, you didn't want to show them the inside of that? Eh, Next I, time. Yeah, yeah, I All just right. feel like showing them the seat. So tell us what you fixed. 
Okay, do we need lights down here? Uh, my phone has a flashlight. Okay, so here, this, this is high and low. Mm -hmm. That's for shifting high and low. And then this one down here, that comes up here, which becomes this. Yeah. That goes on here. So yeah. this is for reverse. And the way this was when we first got it, you can see that. I don't know if you can see that little groove in it. Yeah. It's but got it, the purple stuff. That little it. purple stuff, it was it was on it was right here. So that was half on here and half on here for shifting. And so when we pulled it apart and looked at it and played with it, this thing this it ended up dropping right into here. Yeah. And so I can't I can't see why that isn't where it's supposed to be. So we put it in here and um uh and reverses working all the time yeah so and i'll go inside and i'll i'll pull it up and down or whatever and you can yeah. look at you can look at this while it interacts so you tell them we got we got uh we got low that's low and then we got high 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 and then we go to neutral and then reverse it's gonna go like this that's reverse I'm, I'm guessing you can see pretty well what it's doing in there. Yeah, it's got a flashlight on the newly uh, buffed metal bits they're shining off. Right, and so now we're back in neutral. And then we can show you inside here. If you want to show what we've also done inside here. Is when this, the shifter, yeah. the shifter, there was no space in here. This was all the way up against this. And so every time you want to shift it, you can see it's been scraped out all down here. So what we were able to do was take these two bolts out here and this loosened this all up. And so we were able to push this back down and where it needs to be. And it gave us all the space in the distance here for shifting. Yeah. So now the shifting actually isn't hitting anything and, and be and becoming a and becoming an issue. So I mean everything is pretty nice pretty nice so there you go that's it okay, remember you don't got to push on it just it's just down there you go you're in it right Okay, now you can just use your brake, right? Yeah. Is this working? How's it steer? Steer's pretty good? Yeah, once you're moving. Okay, stop. Clear? Yeah. All right. Take off the gas. Now go. See, it shifted. Did you tell it shifted? You're in a higher gear now? That's how this thing works. See, how come you're over, over there? Yeah, so you got to get used to that steering wheel, dude. Yeah, this thing's a boat. Right, and the steering wheel, on your cars that you drive, what, you go half a turn and yeah, it's already power turned? power steering. A couple seconds off. Now 
Now go again. Did you feel it shift? Yeah. Now go faster. Now you can go a little faster. So did you feel it engage, right? Yeah. It'll go all the way up to that stop sign up there. It's like a boat. It is a boat. So they were this far away, just go ahead and try, let's see how your brakes are, just try them. They're working good? Yeah. Okay. And then once you take your foot off, you're back in low again. Yeah. So you're good. Stop here because you're not out in the road, right? Yeah. Entering looks good. Yeah. Okay. So crank it to the right. Crank it. Crank it. Crank it. There you go. Because if a car's coming the other way, you see what I'm saying? So you just gotta get used. It's gonna take. It's gonna take quite a few turns. Hey, can you tell you're like way in? Take your foot off. Now go. Okay, see what I'm saying? Yeah. So you'll just feel it. No, don't. When I tell you to go to the right, don't just shove it back to the left. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When I tell you go to the right, you go to the right, then you whoa, you take back off to the left. No, watch. Okay, there. See what I'm saying? Yeah. So you got a feeling of can you got a feeling of where that is? Yeah. Okay. Should we you want more of this? And then you're just going to make a ride on the next street. Okay, get out there so you can see, because a lot of cars come down this road all the time. Can you see all the way down the road? Okay. Kind of let it go. It might kind of straighten itself out a little, no? A little bit? Yeah. down this street. Oh, they're going that way. That's okay. You go, 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 go. Go, you go. Not behind you anymore. No. I really need to adjust that mirror. That's right, we can stop right here in the middle of the road. We'll switch places. Yeah, like I said, I wouldn't worry about it. There you go. Okay, neutral. Neutral. Oh, I push the clutch in. Neutral. There you go. Pull the. You still got reverse, right? Yep. Let's try reverse. Oh, that felt good right there. Oh, yeah. We got this low. Feels like we're doing 50. What a boat. What yeah. A boat. <laughs> Thing is, this suspension can handle potholes in those steel plates better than any modern car. 
probably because uh, roads used to be terrible back then. Oh, you hear a click, huh? Yeah. That's when you shift. That's when it shifted. Oh, like this? Yeah. or twice it's it's way better yeah oh see clutch right. and just make sure there's no one coming in behind you when you take off so to go back just all the way dead end we'll just go all the way back down to uh you know what i mean We'll just go back. Yeah, I wouldn't have I wouldn't have shifted it again because yeah. you were going good enough. And I, and I think it'll be just fine. No squealing. Oh, from the brakes and stuff? Yeah. No, that's what we fixed. We fixed those brakes. So where are we gonna work on it? Somewhere with shade. Yeah, you know what I mean? See the shade right there in the dirt? Yeah. So just go over there, we'll just park there. We've parked it there before. More to the right, more to the right. Now straighten it out. Right here, we're in the shade, stop. Yeah. 